Today I'm going to show you how to do a blur effect over your chat windows for sensitive game chat. So in case there's any guild chat or player chat you don't want your stream to read during a multiplayer game, you can have this covered. It's very straightforward and easy. So what we're going to do is we're going to create a new source, which in this case is going to be a display capture. I already have a display a blur display made. So in this case, we're just going to remake a new one, which is going to be blur. You're going to choose your main monitor or your main gaming monitor, which in my case is my 1440. Select this as the main monitor. Okay. That's going to create a new blur window. All right. Then what you want to do is select that new blur window, open up the filters tab, and we're going to add a filter which in this case is going to be scaling and aspect ratio. Okay. You can name it whatever you'd like. If you'd like, you can name it blur in case you plan on adding another scaling and aspect ratio filter over top of this one or with this one. So in this case here, we're going to click this one. We're going to choose the point setting, which will just help it blur a little bit more. Okay. And then at the very bottom, we're going to choose the lowest resolution, which is 853 by 480. Because essentially, we want to blur the screen as much as possible, or make it look as fuzzy as possible. So we're going to close this. Okay, that's all set up now. So we have our filter, our point scaling filter, and our resolution set. Close that. It's going to create a new window at the top here. You're going to click and drag the entire window over top of your existing window. What that's going to do is it's going to mirror your existing display window. But then... You're only going to want to blur out a certain section of the screen. So in this case here, you want to hold Alt, which is going to allow you to click and drag and select a certain part of the screen, which isn't going to change the ratio of the screen we've clicked and dragged, where if you were to just click and drag a certain point, it will change the ratio of the window. So in this case here, we want to keep the ratio the same, right? So we're going to Alt and click and drag, all right, to create that window. So that's our first blur window. So there's one chat box we want to blur down here. And then there's a second one we want to blur over here. So we would add a second blur effect. So again, in this case, it's a little bit easier because we've already made our blur box. We come back to display capture, add existing in this case, because we've already made the blur effect. We're going to choose blur. And again, it's going to give us a window up here. So what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to click and drag it over the entire frame so that it covers the entire screen and then alt and click or alt and drag where you want it to cover. So essentially you want it to cover where we are going to be typing ourselves. So in this case here, you will click and drag pretty much where your chat will go. All right. And then once that's done, you've created two blur effects on the screen that will now cover your chat windows, right? So if I'm to come back over here and actually type in things, now you can see you're no longer able to see my window, but everything else on the screen is as clear as it was before. Anything that isn't in this little box here, right? Or this box over here, is going to be left unblurred, right? But everything in the chat windows is now blurred. All right, folks, and it's that easy. Now you can stream worry-free without having to worry about any stream snipers reading your chat messages, uh, maybe reading locales, or maybe reading guild callouts or anything like that. All right, rest easy and stay healed up, everyone. Have a lovely day.